Now, after this morning's thunderstorm, you wouldn't think many people would be running 5K through Battersea Park, even if it's for charity. But tell that to the hundreds of runners who brave the elements all to raise money for a bypass machine. Among them, one young boy who, without such a machine, wouldn't be here today. Emike Yumulu reports. Meet Anthony Bennett. Three years ago, he fell ill, was resuscitated 12 times, given an 11% chance of survival, spent seven weeks in hospital, had four life-threatening illnesses. He now says he owes his life to one piece of hospital equipment. Now cue one best friend, one girlfriend, one doctor and one TV presenter. They're all hoping to raise this much for one very big cause. Well, it's a heart and lung bypass machine that we're trying to raise money for. It takes a lot of money. I mean, this economic climate, you know, charity work like this is absolutely vital. I owe my life to Great Ormond Street Hospital, and without the machinery and people raising money, then you'll be interviewing someone else, I guess. <laughs> I feel that I owe, I owe Great Ormond Street something for the fact that that one machine they had saved the one best friend that I have. So I just want to give them back what they gave to me. The heart-lung machine saves hundreds of lives each year, 500 to be exact. So it's no wonder so many former patients, relatives and their friends have turned up today despite the rain. But they don't want it to stop here. Organisers are urging dozens of other mums, dads, sisters, doctors and friends to take part in their own charity races to keep that much-needed cycle of goodwill going. Emike Umolu, London Tonight.